Welcome back to the Daily BS. My name is Doug Larson with the Barbell Shrug Podcast. Today's question is about keeping a neutral spine while deadlifting, especially um, during heavier sets above 80%. So uh, it's really easy for the person who asked this question to keep a neutral spine when the weight is light below 80% um, on his type question. Um, above 80% though, he seems like he struggles to keep from pulling into a flex position and to keep a stable shoulder to keep his shoulders back and his, and his back nice and flat. So um, what I would suggest is that instead of finding your true one rep max, the heaviest weight you can get off the floor and stand up with, and what I would do is find what I call a technical one RM. So uh, in our regular CrossFit classes, what we do is we, we shoot for technical three RMs and technical five RMs. You know, what's the heaviest weight you can do perfectly for a three RM and a five RM, which is what you're supposed to do all the time, but what we do is we, we change the name of it so people think about it differently. So it should always be a technical 1RM or a technical 5RM, but if you don't rename it, then people just don't give a shit and they just want to stand up with the weight. So uh, we've all been there. We want to lift as heavy as possible all the time, and it's fun to get a new PR, even if it looks kind of bad and it looks good on paper. But what you should be doing all the time is only pulling with perfect technique all the time. So you want to find out what your, what your 1RM is, you know, with perfect technique, and don't get your one RM that you look like this. Ugh. Okay. You want to you want to get a one RM with perfect technique, and then if you're going to pull 80% of that, you should be able to keep your shoulders back and keep your your back nice and flat, and you won't pull yourself into a flexed, rounded shoulder position if you're going off your technical one RM. So, long story short, basically, I'm suggesting that you light up the weight, lighten up the weight, excuse me, uh, to a point where you can keep that good position because if you only train if you only train where you pull into this position and you're always training in this position and your only your only strategy to fix that is to try harder you're never going to fix it your your strategy should be lighten it up to the point where you can keep everything in a perfect position even if it's heavy that way all the muscles are firing in this position in this shortened position and not this lengthened position that way they get strong in this more shortened position is the easiest way I can say it. That way you're getting strong at the right angles and then you can slowly build up and lift heavier weight in that position rather than the funky position that you keep pulling yourself into when you go extra heavy. Okay? So stick with technical uh, rep max lifts and don't go so heavy that you pull yourself out of position and eventually you'll get stronger in the new position. So it's harder to relearn things than to, than to learn them the first time. So. Uh, it'll, be, it'll be a bit of a struggle and kind of a long-term battle, but um, that is the way that I recommend that you do that. So if you have more questions that you'd like to ask us, uh, you got, that you want us to answer on the Daily BS, you can always go to barbellshrug.com and click the Ask a Question tab at the top of the page, uh, and we can do a Daily BS on that question in the future.